when does the prakriti actually start in a person and does it change over a period of time welcome to yet another shloka under the world as doshas okay so this this week under the shloka of the week i uh, am trying to i will try to um, explain that shloka which discusses about uh, the uh, prakriti of people how these prakriti of people are defined and how is vata pitta and kapha prakriti lot of people worldwide are uh, you know whenever they uh, meet me common men they want to know what prakriti am i am i vata pitta or kapha you know and they have got a lot of doubts regarding these vata pitta kapha which i will discuss as we go through the shloka okay so today shloka of the week okay this is again from ashtanga hridaya first chapter 10th shloka and this is how the shloka goes शुक्रार्थवस्थे जन्मादौ विषयनेव विषक्रमेह तैश्च तिस्र प्रकृतयो हीन मध्योत्तमा पृथक द ट्रान्सलिटरेशन शुक्रार्थवस्थे जन्मादौ विषयनेव विषक्रमेह तैश्च तिस्र प्रकृतयो हीन मिथ्या हीन मध्योत्तमा पृथक ओके सो हियर आई गो बैक टू द श्लोक शुक्रार्थवस्थे जन्माद विषय विषक्रमे तयश्च तिस्र प्रकृत आल कम टू द फर्स्ट पार्ट लेटर सो तयश्च इन देंस प्रकृति ओके तयश्च तिस्र प्रकृत देर आर थ्री प्रकृति प्रिडोमली ओके इट्स नॉट दैट दैट हंड्रेड पर्सेंट वाता हंड्रेड पर्सेंट पिता हंड्रेड पर्सेंट का फा नो बाय प्रिडोमस देर आर थ्री प्रकृति तयश्च तिस्र प्रकृत हीन मध्योत्तमा पृथक सो देर इज वाता प्रकृति देर इज पिता प्रकृति एंड देर इज कफा प्रकृति प्रिडोमस ओके एंड इन दोज प्रिडोमस दे हैव टोल्ड दीज थ्री वाता पिता कफा इज हीन मध्य एंड उत्तम ओके हीन मीन्स स्लाइटली लो क्वालिटी ओके मध्य मीन्स मीडियम क्वालिटी उत्तम मीन्स बेस्ट क्वालिटी so according to when you have got vata predominance okay it becomes hina or low quality when it is pitta it is medium and when it is kapha predominant it becomes uttama prakriti i'll come to that why so this is the way uh, vata pitta and kapha prakritis have been divided so you have got vata prakriti pitta prakriti kapha prakriti and vata is hina kapha pitta is madhya and kapha is uttama let us go to the previous part of it okay shukrartavasthe janmado visheneva vishakramehe this line explains how a prakriti in a person how a prakriti comes into a person okay in the sense um, uh, this is this is a way, this is a nice way of putting it so, so shukrartavasthe janmado shukra means uh, the uh, sperm and artava means the ovum so when the fertilization happens between the sperm and the ovum that is when the prakriti of a person is decided okay shukrartavasthe janmado so what comes out what uh, is born out of a shukra artava samyoga okay uh, the uh, the fertilization of an uh, ovum and a sperm what is born at that point of time prakriti of a person is determined okay and how vishayane eva vishakrame he it is like you know um, visha means poison vishakrame means an organism or an animal or a reptile it can be any, any living being with poison just like if you look at a snake for example a poisonous creature nobody injects poison into the snake after it grows you know that poison that poison is in the snake when it is born or at the time of the fertilization of the sperm and the ovum of the snake okay nobody injects it 
that it that is its nature of having poison inside it likewise the prakriti of a person is also inside a person and which is determined at the time of fertilization okay so what is determined at the time of fertilization is prakriti so let us get into the meaning of it the prakriti of a person is decided at the time of fertilization like the poison in a poisonous creature okay there are three you may, i mean the prakritis are three vata pitta and kapha it is in predominance where the quality is poor medium and best respectively okay so this is the meaning of the shloka and when you look in a deeper insight you know the prakriti even though has been mentioned as poor medium and best for vata pitta kapha it does it mean that vata prakriti is inferior in any way okay physically yes he'll have his own issues one thing if you note you know uh, uh, the first stage of a life if you remember the shloka the first part of a life is kapha the middle part is pitta and the last part is vata so a person with vata prakriti will have very less issues of kapha when he is a child but a kapha prakriti person will have more kapha issues when he is a child and as he reaches old age you know and if you note that the the kapha period is very small might be about about 15 10 to 15 might be 12 to 15 years from birth but the vata say if you take it from 50 it nowadays people live till 70 80 you know so it's about 30 years, double this part so a vata person will be healthy in the kapha area for 15 years but when he enters the vata state you understand when he enters the vata state the remain the 30 years uh, it might not be an easy ride for him but for the kapha person the first 15 years might be a struggle but the last 30 years because he is kapha person it is easier for him to manage that is one reason they have told that kapha person his prakriti is slightly superior but vata pitta kapha are all see here when you look at uh, ayurveda we have discussed in the early shlokas that dharmartha kama moksha when you are in your spiritual travel when you are going towards moksha these things don't matter at all whether you are vata prakriti pitta prakriti or kapha prakriti if you are disciplined all the vata pitta kapha prakriti have got an equal chance an equal opportunity to reach moksha okay that's what for achieving the purusharthas all have an equal chance there is no confusion about that then usually other other questions which people ask us do you think uh, a doctor does the prakriti of a person change over a period of time no okay as we said vishayena eva vishakrame he just like the poison in the poisonous organism the the poison is already inside and only over a period of time you know it matures likewise the prakriti of a person over a period of time you, that's in the reason it sometimes in children you are not able to find out what prakriti they are but as they mature their prakriti also matures and that prakriti never ever changes he he is born with a prakriti he lives through with a prakriti and he dies with that prakriti only behaviorally he can work around it and knowing what his prakriti is very important so that he can actually live his life according to his prakriti to make to make the life as comfortable as possible but the prakriti of a person never ever changes thank you